question 39 find the round skin of x and x e raised to x hence conclude whether or not these are linearly independent if they are linearly independent set up the differential equation having them as its independent solution so we have going straight to the solution So round skin is defined as y one x, y two x, y one dash x, y two dash x. So this becomes our x x e raised to x one uh, x e raised to x plus e raised to x this becomes uh, x square e raised to x plus x e raised to x minus x e raised to x becomes x square e raised to x uh, we have our round skin as x square e raised to x we can see that uh, w round skin is not equal to 0 for uh, uh, if x not equal to 0 so in the interval uh, so in the interval minus infinity to infinity uh, wx is not uh, we cannot say wx is identically equal to 0 meaning uh, not every x uh, makes wx 0 so uh, therefore we can say that y1 of x and y2 x are linearly independent so that part that first part is over now we have to find a differential equation uh, which has these y1 x and y2 x as independent solution so that is the tricky part and that is the lengthier part of the solution so since uh, we uh, these y1 x and y2 x are independent solutions we can write uh, y equal to sorry y equal to a into y1 plus b into y2 that is y equal to a is uh, a into a constant an arbitrary constant a and we are uh, being arbitrary parameters so a into we got y uh, we have y1 x x x a x plus b into x e raised to x x e raised to x so this is our equation uh, let this be equation 1 uh, our equation 1 so and d by dx on 1 we get y dash equal to a plus b into uh, differential of x e raised to x is x e raised to x plus e raised to x so this is our equation 2 now since we have two arbitrary constants we need to differentiate it one more time to eliminate uh, the arbitrary constant two two arbitrary constants so we get y double dash equal to b into x e raised to x plus e raised to x plus e raised to x therefore y double dash equal to b into uh, x e raised to x plus 2 e raised to x so this is our equation 3 now uh, we need to find uh, so uh, from this from 3 from 3 we can write b is equal to uh, y double dash by x e raised to x plus 2 e raised to x so this is b we got our b so 4 now we can use 2 to find a from 2 we have a equal to y dash minus b into x e raised to x plus e raised to x so that gives y dash minus y double dash by x e raised to x plus 2 e raised to x 
into x e raised to x plus e raised to x. So before before opening up, we can simplify this by taking e raised to x outside x plus one by e raised to x into x plus two. So this e raised to x cancels out. Now we can write x plus two y dash minus x plus one y x plus two a equal to. Now on further uh, uh, we can now we can uh, this is equation five. So we got a and b. We can substitute this in our new equation. Uh, so our our equation y. Oh, once again, new page. Um, y equal to sorry. Y equal to a e raised to x plus b into we have x e raised to x so therefore y equal to from previous sample we got a as this x into this part so sorry e raised to x Sorry, this uh, I wrote y wrong here. This is a, this a x. So the given question was a x. So x into. Uh, we'll copy this part here. So x into this. So a into a into x plus instead of b we have this this part. Sorry, copy this. Next. Uh, so we have x e raised to x into so this so we can take e raised to x common here also so i didn't so th therefore y equal to uh, x plus 2 x by y equal to x by x plus 2 can be taken common from both these equations. So it becomes x plus 2 y dash minus y double dash into x plus 1. And e raised to x get cancelled. x plus 2 is only left. So that goes plus x y double dash. So it simplifies to this equation. Therefore, y equal to x by x plus 2 into uh, so x y dash plus 2 y dash minus x y double dash minus y double dash plus x y double dash. So these term cancels out 2 y dash minus. So there is nothing. Okay. So taking, therefore simplifying x y plus two x equal to two uh, x y dash minus x y double dash plus x square y double dash. So. This is the required equation. So if 
we want to simplify this further we can write this in the form x x square y double dash we take x y dash common mm, y dash term mm, sorry 2 plus x So if we take y dash term is the solution given is minus two x y dash okay minus x square y dash. There is a missing term here x square y dash. okay there is a mistake here so these two terms doesn't cancel out this is y double dash I made a mistake there so okay we for simplification we will do one thing we will just keep we will we'll not open this x plus 2 term we will just keep it as it is so what we have is so from this step what he have is y into x plus 2 is equal to x y dash into x plus 2 minus y double dash into x plus 1 y double dash if you take further uh, sorry uh, if you take x y double dash common we get x plus 1 plus x so this becomes this becomes uh, y double dash common if you take m minus y double dash as common x plus 1 sorry x plus 1 minus Uh, x so that becomes y double dash so minus x y double dash so our solution becomes So this can two plus x two plus x y there is still an x here. okay there was a mistake here sorry uh, here we took x by x plus 2 as common uh, e raised to x get gets cancelled so here 
it becomes x plus 2 okay the e raised to uh, and there is no x here since we took our x out there is no x here there is only y double dash so our equation uh, here when we take uh, y double dash as common what is left is here sorry what is left here is minus y double dash as common x plus 1 uh, minus 1 so it becomes x y double dash into x therefore it becomes x square y double dash so this is the equation so therefore we get x square y double dash plus uh, sorry minus minus x y dash into x plus 2 plus y into x plus 2 equal to 0 this is the required differential equation so the mistake I did was in wrote x y double dash here so <laughs> Just be careful when you write steps. Uh, one small mistake can mess up the solution. So this is the solution. Uh, required differential equation. It is of second order. We eliminated successfully the both arbitrary constants. So just go. I will go through the steps again. So we got our A, B and substituted in the equation 1. Uh, so this is the solution to question 39.